You can create mind-blowing soundscapes in Unreal Engine 5, even if you're just starting out. And I'm going to show you how. Let's dive in. Sound is very important. Without sound, there is no ambience, no atmosphere. The first step towards realism is sound. Let's import sounds in Unreal Engine. We have to use only waveform format audio files. If you have MP3 format files, you can convert them in waveform. With Audacity application, it's free and easy to use. Just import your MP3 in Audacity and save as WAV format. That's all. Now import the files in Unreal Engine. Here's a scene I created before. There is no sound and no soul, no atmosphere. It doesn't make any sense. It was actually a game project that was dropped. Anyway, I created a folder named Sounds and dragged the files in it. We need an ambient sound for the scene. Let's add one. Just drag an ambient sound in the scene. Set the sound file. Yes, things are getting better. Okay, let's talk about attenuation. If we move away from the sound coming from a certain area, it becomes more and more difficult to hear that sound, right? This effect can be given by attenuation. Let's say we get a sound from this machine and it gets more silent as we move away. Let's do that, it's easy. Now add another sound near this machine. I have a sound for this machine. In details panel, there is an attenuation section. Click the override attenuation and reduce the inner radius and fall off distance. Let's test it. As you can see, the volume decreases when I move away. That's what we wanted. Let's take a look at the play sound node. We can add sound at the doors. In this scene, let's do it. When we enter the door blueprints event graph, there is an event that open and close the door. You can watch this door tutorial from this channel. After the bool set, node add a play sound 2D node for opening sound. And add another one for closing sound. Yes, it's working well. Now take a look at the sound cue. Let's create one. It gives us a lot of options. You can control more than one sounds in a single sound cue with all sound parameters. Let's try this for the door. For open sound, closed sound, and locked effect, we will use only one sound cue. First, I will add my sounds in here with Wave Player. There is a branch node, as you see. We need a parameter for this node. Name it is open. Now, if it is true, we want to play the open audio. If not, the close audio will be played. Okay, what if it's locked? Here we need another branch node. Parameter name will be locked. If the door set to locked, this audio will be played. Okay? Now combine this two. There is more than one way to do this. I will use Mixer node. Save here and turn back to Door Blueprint. Delete the Play Sound 2D nodes and add an audio component. Set the Door Sound Cue and Audio Component. Take it here. From this call, a Set Boolean Parameter node We must type the parameter name exactly same in sound cue. At open branch, set bool true. Copy that. And this will be false. Play audio.
And from here, from false, copy another set boolean parameter, and bool name will be locked. Set it true and play audio again. As you see, we use only one audio for all sounds. And if we want to make a change, just go to the sound cue blueprint. From here, we can change audio files, volume and pitch values, and all other sound parameters. Now try Mixer at our machine here. Create a new sound cue and name it Machine Sound Cue. We will mix two sounds here, a machine sound and steam pipe sound. It's easy. Just add two sounds and connect to the mixer node. and add a loop node here. Add this to machine's audio, that's it. Concatenators for sequencing and playing sounds. Looping, as the name implies, puts it in a loop. Modulator allows you to randomly adjust the parameters of sounds. And switch allows us to play sounds according to an index with a parameter. You can try other nodes in your own sound cue. Keep tinkering. If you're finding value in these videos, Hit that subscribe button and drop a like if you love the content and ring the bell to stay updated. See you in the restaurant at the end of the universe.